so firstly go to file then click on new we have this width 1366 height 768 resolution 72 I want click on ok and uh, two mandatory step is there uh, one I want to choose my gray tone for my background so you can randomly choose a gray tone like AC AC and AC is the color I want for my background now fill it with this color and uh, for my text color I will choose uh, firstly I will choose this same color and uh, on to the bill of this color I will choose this dark gray tone now click on ok choose this text tool now put your text here AC I want to put it here that's very fine okay now select both layers now go to this move tool make it align horizontal as well as vertical now control 0 to fit it on screen okay now make another copy of this text by pressing control J now hide this right click on any one of this text layer uh, go to new 3d execution from selected layer now click on ok now you don't need to have to do nothing and uh, just directly go to layers then uh, this background I want to change it to postcard right click on there then we have this postcard okay now we have three layers I will show you uh, this is my text layer 3d this is my background and this is my text already that I have make it hidden okay now select both layers control click on there control click on this layer and uh, you will have the selection now control E to merge both layers okay now go to 3d again double click on this environment in environment we have intensity many of the visitors they have uh, they want how to work with the light so here is the tool intensity now intensity means light so I will put it to about 165 shadow I want uh, about uh, 28 29 that's fine now just go to 3d and click on render now it will take around 5 to 6 minutes to render so we are ready with the text 3d text now again go to layer now this is my 3d layer right click on there then click on rasterize 3d now we have two layers one is hidden active inactive layer one is 3d layer okay now active this layer this text now press ctrl t to transform it so i will match it with the text now it requires a practice to make it match with the 3d that's what fine now choose move tool and you can move it to any direction okay that's fine now this is very very accurate now fill I want 0 for this right click on there and go to blending options firstly uh, I will try this blending gradient overlay and uh, reverse it reverse the angle I mean and set its blend mode to soft light and even you can try this overlay I think soft light is working better that's fine I want this mm. now uh, go to this bevel and uh, increase the depth of this bevel and uh, increase the opacity for white particularly like this and uh, even you can change the angle mm that's very fine 
capacity for black I want about uh, 20 20 is fine mm. just click on there this is before and this is after so this is before and this is after we have this background layer now make a another copy by pressing ctrl J right click on there go to blending options gradient overlay I want uh, soft light I will try soft light firstly and what's it mm. again and we'll try to inverse it just reduce the opacity so this is before and this is after again this is before and after again right click on there and I will do some changes Now click on OK. We are ready with the text. Okay, now again make a copy by pressing Ctrl Shift Alt E to merge all layers. I will put some special effect to this. Mm, just go to filter and uh, we have this camera raw. Firstly, go to this sharpness. I want to reduce the noise. So I want very sleek and increase its sharpness that's looking awesome and uh, I will uh, play with the j setting of this that's looking very fine Okay, this is before and this is after. Now click on OK. Uh, this is before and uh, this is after just with few seconds I got this again make a new layer on there and uh, choose any color from there like this I have choose this color gray and uh, choose your brush hit once on there and uh, set its blend mode to color dodge control T to transform it something like this I want okay reduce its opacity uh, I will try to put it there okay I want it here again make a new layer choose your brush hit once on there set its plan mode to linear dodge I will try and that's fine control T make it large I want a light source that is coming from outside looking like that something like this you can see in the screen suppose light is coming from this side even you can make it small okay 
Mm, this is the text we got it and final it is depend on you what color you want for this particular text if you want any color just go there and choose color balance so now just play with the settings like this you got this so I hope you got idea to make this 3d design by your inscription so please subscribe our channel you can follow us even we have blog now if you want to learn about photography and if you want to see some images amazing images you can access our blog so thank you friends keep watching our inscription